Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 13th, okay? So right around the 13th, we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 13th? camera's a little crooked. That's okay, right? Doesn't matter. What do we have for around the 13th? The lovers. So the lovers is that choice. It's a choice. Somebody is making a choice in regards to love. Looks like it's unexpected. Do you see the look on their faces? It's kind of like, hmm. Looks like, are you sure? Yeah. I mean, we have an angel that is bringing two people together. All right. But there's some uncertainty here. So there's uncertainty. It's a perfect match with a lover's card. Now, it doesn't have to be romance related. It, it, could be it absolutely could be this is a uh, union that is divinely orchestrated for some reason so I thought I turned that off apparently I didn't temperance reversed I'm gonna go I'm gonna go turn that off okay Sorry about that. I had to go turn that off. Um, so we got temperance reversed. That's unbalanced. So we have a choice. We have somebody here that is having a hard time accepting something, fighting it, fighting it because the temperance is reversed. So they're fighting a, a, a decision, a choice that they need to make in regards to a partnership. It's like they're presented with this option, this opportunity. But temperance reverses lack of acceptance, lack of compromise, having a hard time coming together, having a hard time uh, getting together or something like that. Something is off, repeating negative patterns with temperance reversed. There's uh, why there's not because it, there's some sort of frustrations here, uneasiness, unwillingness to accept that it's, you know, we talked about this yesterday or the day before. It was the day before yesterday. Um, lack of accepting that this is a better match, okay? It's a better partnership. Uh, having a hard time accepting. Now this could go with, go for you in, in many different ways. We have several peop, several thousand people that watch this. We may have somebody here that is having a hard time accepting that whoever it is that they are unwilling to let go of because temperance comes after death. You know, they're having a hard time accepting that their person went with somebody else. Perhaps they found a better match. There's a lack of acceptance here fighting it, fighting it, fighting it. There's also a story here where somebody has a perfect match and they're fighting it because they are not accepting a previous ending. It's hard to accept, okay? It's hard to accept with temperance reversed. Um, repeating negative patterns. There's something better here, but there's a choice that needs to be made. Um, page of pentacles reversed. Now that's a dead end, okay? It's it's lack of focus, lost sight. Somebody's lost sight of their goals. They're stuck. They don't want to put in the work. They, they're lazy. They're complacent. They're uh, not being practical. We have somebody here that um, is throwing away an opportunity or they're not. They need to, they need to broaden their horizons, but they're not because it's right next to temperance reverse. There's, there's definitely a, a opportunity for a union here, but there's a lack of acceptance that, uh, one, it's almost like one door is closed. You know, the door is closed. You need to accept it. So I don't know who that, who that message is for. Uh, page of Pentacles reversed. That is, uh, 
you know, having a hard time starting over or going down a new path. We need somebody that, or we have somebody here that needs to walk forward, okay? They need to step forward. They need to uh, broaden their horizons and realize, you know, temperance is a card of purpose. It's a card of reason. You know, everything happens for a reason, but we have somebody here that is delaying. They're at a standstill with the Page of Pentacles reversed because, you know, I feel like they just are having a hard time accepting. There is a union here that is that is divinely orchestrated, put it that way. Whether it's it's whoever you've been holding on to that is not interested. I mean, the, the Page of Pentacles reversed is not interested. I'm... It's not putting in any effort. We have somebody here that's not putting any any effort to a, a partnership that is, uh, yeah, they're not putting in any effort. And it could just be because they feel like something is off or they're unbalanced or they're not ready or, and this may come when you're not ready because the temperance is reversed. It's like I'm not, not ready for this. So it could be very, very sudden. Something could be happening suddenly. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Now we have dead end twice because dead end, page of Pentacles and the seven of Pentacles reversed. There could be a relocation here. We have somebody here that has been, you know, uh, not investing in something because they're not being practical or they're not willing to change or they're not ready. They're not ready for change. They're not investing in something. They've been holding on to some sort of dead end. I do see that because temperance comes after death. Okay, something has ended and it's hard to accept. You need to stop investing in that dead end because it's a perfect match here. But anyhow, seven of pentacles reverse, lack of investment next to the page of pentacles reverse. So somebody needs to pick up and go someplace else. Okay, that's that's relocate or... Plant your seeds someplace else, you know. Um, go where the ground is more fer more fertile. But there's some sort of laziness or lack of acceptance. Repeating, repeating negative patterns, trying to water a dead tree. Stop watering a dead tree. You can't make it come back. Trust me, I've tried. Picking up, going someplace else. That's what needs to happen. There could be, there could be some uneasiness on this day. Eight of Swords Reverse. This is an obstacle being removed. Maybe it's fear. Somebody has been playing it safe. They've been staying inside, staying, you know, keeping a barrier up, staying, uh, staying put, staying in a place where they've been restricted, they've been re um, confined, or choosing to be though. Somebody has chosen to restrict themselves. They've been able to escape for a long time. They've been able to remove themselves from a situation, but they haven't, but it is reversed. So there's bit, this is removing an obstacle. So somebody is an obstacle of fear or complacency or laziness or something like that is about to be removed. Somebody's about to uh, break free from some sort of restriction, some sort of confinement. They are. They've been uh, controlled. Maybe they didn't have the money or something. They've been con held back by uh, lack of funding, <laughs> you know. Um, something is definitely off. Somebody's about to stop investing if they haven't already. They're going to stop investing in a situation where there's lack. I mean, temperance reverse. There's, there's something better out there, okay? But you have to be willing to grab onto it. Anyway, removing an obstacle. So an obstacle is being removed. Somebody is about to step outside of their comfort zone. They need to. They need to start investing in something else. 
because there's a perfect opportunity here. There is. But the choice is always yours. The lovers is a card of consequences, okay? It is, okay? You, you can choose to live or to refuse to accept that something is over and continue investing in that dead end that is never coming back or you can accept what they're bringing to you or what they've brought to you, whatever is in front of you, you know? Breaking free from that old mentality as well with the aid of uh, swords reversed, removing an obstacle. Um, oh, we have the moon. So the moon is all is not as it seems. Uh, there's something that is hidden. Somebody is hiding something. The moon is ruled by Pisces, but I also see it as Cancer because Cancer is ruled by the moon, so it's Pisces and Cancer. All is not as it seems. We also have Gemini here with the Lover's card, Sagittarius with Temperance, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn with the Page of Pentacles. But we have everybody, so it doesn't really matter, but there's some secrets here. There's so, All is not as it seems. The, the, somebody is hiding something. They're, and maybe they're, they're extremely fearful. They're fearful of change. Um... There's an unclear and difficult path ahead, but there's a need to go down that path. Don't let fear hold you back. Go down that path. We have somebody who are here who has been held back by fear. We have the Eight of Swords reversed next to the Moon card. So somebody has been held back by fear. They may have been confused. They may have been in some sort of illusionary state of mind, you know, uh, not seeing very clearly, not seeing very clearly that they were... Uh, letting fear control them or letting even another person control them. Um, I do feel like we have somebody here that um, is having a hard time uh, facing their fears, but there is an option here that is perfect. It's absolutely perfect. Hangman underneath the lover. So we could definitely have Gemini. We have Pisces. Um, hangman is represented by Pisces, but that if it's Hangman reversed, so this is. I think we have somebody here that is really, really, really unhappy. This person has been trying to prove something. Um, They may have become enlightened. You know, somebody may have become enlightened or they're becoming enlightened. This is somebody that probably wanted to punish another person. I mean, the hangman can be a martyr, you know, or they, they're unwilling to budge, unwilling to look at things from a new perspective. It's my way or the highway, but this is reversed. You know, this is it. This is, you know, this is a... Uh, uh, refusing to budge next to the temperance card we have somebody here that has been refusing to uh, to accept something they've been trying to prove a point um, I think that this person has become enlightened in some way the hangman reverse or they're about to become enlightened the hangman is struggling in reverse this is an extreme struggle struggling to open up struggling to let go of their stance uh, will not change definitely hiding something somebody is hiding something or they're unwilling to open up they're sacrificing themselves needlessly for their point you know i got a point to prove you know so i'm gonna i'm gonna waste away i'm gonna waste my life or whatever just because i got a point to prove to somebody um the hangman reverse that is refusing struggling struggling to let go struggling to open up trying to prove a point but something is off we have somebody that is uh i don't know maybe they're they're very frustrated they're frustrated with their current circumstances there's no growth and they're they're current because the seven of pentacles reverse that's no growth something isn't growing it's dead it's dead something is dead There's illusion, there's fantasy, there's confusion. There could even be some addictions here. You may have somebody that has been masking their feelings with addictions. Uh, 
Unexpected choice in love. Are you sure? You know, is this is this really is this really who it is? You know, that kind of thing. There's a need to open up. There's a need to look at things differently. There's a need to let go. Let go of your fear. There's a need to look at things differently. I think I just said that. Um, accept that something is over. Stop wasting your time. Stop wasting your time. Some people try to prove a point because, you know, they get themselves into a relationship and they're embarrassed when it doesn't work, work out. So they stay trapped in that relationship just to prove to everybody that they didn't make a mistake. You know, that's ego. And the hey man reversed is ego. Feel free to look it up. Um, so we do have somebody here that is repeating negative patterns. And they need to stop doing that. They need to stop investing in things where there's no growth, where there's no fertility. I, and I feel like there's going to be an obstacle that is being removed. Somebody's about to remove themselves uh, from the situation that they are in that is based on... It's fantasy or illusion with the moon card. There's, there's, there's some sort of lies here with the eight of swords reversed and the moon. The moon is ruled by the shadow. What you see is not what you get. Okay, the shadow makes things appear completely different than what they really are. So somebody is in a situation that is not growing because it's not fertile. There's no, there's no love in these cards except for the very first card. And that's another option. Okay, that is another option. So yeah. Justice 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 is a card of truth being revealed everything turning out as it should so this is a fair and just decision that is being made to stop investing in a contract that is going nowhere. I mean, it's a false contract. I mean, we have contract twice in the lovers and the justice card. So there's some sort of contract here. Finalization, final, final, final. Something is being made from, could be a final decision. Making a final decision, doing the right thing, acting with integrity. Somebody is about to do something that they've been having a very, they've been struggling with. They've been struggling, 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 struggling with that hey man reverse, going back and forth, sacrificing themselves, wasting their time with a partnership that's probably not been easy. It's not been easy. They've been having a hard time accepting that they need change, that it's over. Um, but I do believe that a decision is about to be made. I think it is somebody's about to make the right decision. They are about to break free from some sort of restriction that they have been refusing. It's almost like be refusing to acknowledge, you know, that they've been trapped. Maybe they've been trapped in their mind. They've been letting their mind get the best of them. They're trying to prove a point to somebody because of ego, you know, and whatever. Anyhow, um... All is not as it seems. There is something that is going on below the surface that is about to pop up. Um, this is, there's some sort of truth that is about to come out. This truth is going to finalize some sort of decision. It's going to help somebody to break free from their restrictions. A new perspective is about to be gained. You will need to accept that something is over. You know, it's, this is about acceptance. And refusing to accept is only going to make things worse. So somebody has been in a situation that has not been growing. There's no growth. It's dead. It's completely dead. You can't make it come back. It's it's, it's over, and it's been so frustrating. And um, there's a reason why things don't work out because there's a better option here. But there's a need to stop trying to prove something and take steps in that new direction. Um, face your fears and realize that it's not going to be easy. Yes. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead, but but there's lessons to be learned along the way. Justice, a fair and just decision that is being made. Something has been hidden. It's about to be revealed. Something is off. 
Something is definitely off. We have somebody here that has been trying to prove something that isn't... It's almost like it's not, it's not real. It's not provable. It was all a lie. And they're, it feels like they're getting caught in some way or they're needing to, or they're going to accept or some sort of reality check or something like that is here. Um, get prepared for some sort of big decision to be made. Uh, there could also be some punishment here with the hangman reverse and justice card and the eight of swords. Those, somebody could end up in jail. And that's another whole message for somebody else. There's, there could be jail. There could be handcuffs here. There's just getting tied up, you know, getting put in a, taken away by the law for doing something, you know, extreme. Temperance reverse is extreme, you know, doing something extreme, going overboard. There could be some addictions here. Somebody could be going overboard. Okay, they could end up in jail. They could do something, you know, without thinking. This is somebody that isn't very practical, that lacks responsibility. Um, so somebody could end up in jail. They could get caught doing something. Well, I don't know if they're, they're on drugs or alcohol or something like that. Um, they've been lying, hiding something, and the truth comes out. Um, so, yeah. And that's what I got. Good luck.